Right now, deep beneath Campi Flegre, one of the deadliest supervolcanoes on Earth, a massive seismic swarm is shaking the ground like never before. Scientists are sounding alarms as magma rises, causing the surface to swell and hundreds of small earthquakes to rattle the area. This isn't just geological activity. It's a warning sign that this sleeping giant could erupt with devastating force. An eruption here wouldn't just destroy Naples. It could trigger global climate chaos, darken skies worldwide, and affect millions of lives across continents. Experts struggle to predict when or how strong the eruption will be, but one thing is clear. We are on the edge of a potentially catastrophic event. Stay with us, because what happens next could change everything. Campi Flegre, translating to burning fields, is a vast volcanic area west of Naples, encompassing 24 craters and volcanic edifices. This supervolcano has a history of massive eruptions, with the last significant one occurring in 1538, forming the Monte Nuovo. The region is densely populated, housing over 1.5 million people, making any potential eruption a matter of grave concern. The caldera's structure is complex, with a vast magma chamber lying beneath the surface. Recent studies have shown that the ground in this area has been uplifting, a phenomenon known as bradyseism, indicating magma movement beneath. Since 2005, the ground has risen by over 1.2 meters, a significant change that cannot be ignored. This uplift is accompanied by increased seismic activity, with thousands of micro-earthquakes recorded in recent years. These signs suggest that the volcanic system is becoming increasingly unstable. Seismic swarms, clusters of earthquakes occurring over a short period, have become more frequent in Campi Flegre. These swarms are indicative of magma and gas movement beneath the surface, increasing the pressure within the caldera. The most recent swarm included over 150 earthquakes in a single day, with magnitudes reaching up to 4.4. Such activity is unprecedented in the area's recent history. Scientists from the National Institute of Geophysics and Volcanology, INGV, have been closely monitoring these developments. Their research suggests that the crust beneath the caldera is weakening, making it more susceptible to rupture. The combination of ground uplift and seismic swarms points towards a potential eruption scenario. However, predicting the exact timing remains a challenge. Campi Flegre's history is marked by catastrophic eruptions, the most notable being the Campanian Ignimbrite eruption around 39,000 years ago. This event released approximately 200 cubic kilometers of magma, impacting global climates and leading to significant ecological changes. Ash from this eruption has been found across Eastern Europe, highlighting its vast reach. Such historical events underscore the potential dangers posed by this supervolcano. The last eruption in 1538, though smaller, still had significant local impacts creating new landforms and altering the landscape. These historical patterns indicate that Campi Flegre operates on long dormancy periods, followed by explosive activity. The current signs of unrest are reminiscent of those preceding past eruptions. Understanding this history is crucial for preparing for future events. The densely populated areas surrounding Campi Flegre, including Naples and Pozzuoli, are at significant risk in the event of an eruption. Evacuation plans have been developed, but the sheer number of residents presents logistical challenges. In past instances of increased activity, temporary evacuations have been implemented, causing social and economic disruptions. The psychological toll on residents living under constant threat is also considerable. Local authorities have been conducting drills and public awareness campaigns to prepare the population However, the unpredictability of volcanic activity makes it difficult to maintain a constant state of readiness. The balance between caution and normalcy is delicate, and missteps can lead to either complacency or panic. Effective communication and community engagement are vital components of disaster preparedness. An eruption of Campi Flegre would have far-reaching environmental consequences. The release of volcanic gases 
particularly sulfur dioxide, could lead to acid rain and contribute to atmospheric cooling. Ash clouds could disrupt air travel across Europe, as seen during the Ejaf Yala Jokul eruption in 2010. The deposition of ash would also affect agriculture, contaminating water supplies and soil. Marine ecosystems in the Bay of Naples would be threatened by pyroclastic flows and tsunamis, especially if the eruption involves underwater vents. The alteration of landforms could also impact local biodiversity, leading to habitat loss. Long-term climate effects could include a temporary global temperature drop, affecting weather patterns and crop yields. These environmental risks necessitate comprehensive monitoring and mitigation strategies. The economic impact of a Campi Flegre eruption would be substantial. The immediate costs would include infrastructure damage, business interruptions, and emergency response expenditures. Tourism, a significant industry in the region, would suffer due to safety concerns and travel disruptions. Long-term economic recovery would depend on the severity of the eruption and the effectiveness of response measures. Insurance claims and reconstruction efforts would strain financial resources, potentially requiring international aid. The agricultural sector would face losses from crop damage and soil contamination. Supply chain disruptions could extend beyond Italy, affecting European markets. Proactive investment in disaster preparedness can mitigate some of these economic risks. Advancements in technology have enhanced the monitoring of volcanic activity at Campi Flegre. Seismographs, GPS stations, and satellite imagery provide real-time data on ground movements and gas emissions. Researchers analyze this data to identify patterns and potential warning signs of eruptions. Collaborations between international institutions have improved the understanding of the caldera's behavior. Recent studies have focused on the role of hydrothermal systems and their contribution to surface deformation. Understanding the interactions between magma, water, and rock is crucial for accurate predictions. Continuous research efforts aim to refine eruption forecasting models. Public access to monitoring data enhances transparency and community trust in scientific assessments. Effective emergency response plans are essential for minimizing casualties during a volcanic crisis. Authorities have designated evacuation zones and established protocols for different eruption scenarios. Regular drills and public education campaigns aim to ensure community readiness. Coordination between local, regional, and national agencies is critical for efficient response. Challenges include ensuring timely communication, managing evacuation logistics, and providing shelter and resources for displaced individuals. Special attention is required for vulnerable populations, including the elderly and those with disabilities. Post-eruption recovery plans must address housing, healthcare, and economic rehabilitation. Investing in resilience building measures can enhance community capacity to withstand and recover from disasters. The effects of a Campi Flegre eruption would extend beyond Italy's borders. Disruptions to air travel could affect international commerce and tourism. Ash clouds and atmospheric changes might influence global weather patterns, leading to agricultural challenges in distant regions. The event could prompt a reevaluation of volcanic risk management worldwide. International cooperation in monitoring and response efforts would be essential. Sharing data and resources can facilitate a more effective global response. The eruption would also serve as a case study for improving preparedness for other supervolcanoes. Understanding the interconnectedness of such events underscores the importance of global collaboration. While the potential for a catastrophic eruption exists, proactive measures can mitigate risks. Continued investment in scientific research, infrastructure resilience, and public education is vital. Engaging communities in preparedness efforts fosters a culture of safety and awareness. Policymakers must prioritize funding and support for disaster risk reduction initiatives. 
The situation at Campi Flegre serves as a reminder of the dynamic nature of our planet. Balancing development with respect for natural hazards is a complex but necessary endeavor. By learning from past events and embracing innovation, societies can better navigate the challenges posed by living in geologically active regions. Preparedness today can save lives tomorrow. Ives.